Ohio Valley. With your storm team weather, here's meteorologist Brittany Lawrence. Welcome back to KSAT News at 10. Well, some changes on the way in our forecast. We're getting another taste of some snow as we approach January and a way to bring in 2021 here. Let's look at the weather headlines to see exactly what we're expecting. Winter storm warning is in effect for our area here in San Angelo and portions of Northern County. Big County, some areas, and also portions of northern counties in Contra Valley. A rain snow mix is expected to kick off midnight. That's pretty much going to open the doorway to the trend. Snow on Sunday, mainly on Sunday, clearing out by late Sunday evening. And then we start to clear out into the rest of the week as well. Once we get that low moved out of our area, we start to change as well. Here's how we look temperature-wise today. Got up to 51 degrees today. That's pretty much below average for this time of year. Average is 59. Record is 85 degrees in 2000. 2009. Record low this morning, 23 degrees. That's well off from 33 degrees for our average tier around this time of year. So we have been getting a taste of some winter weather here across much of the Contra Valley. Already seeing 45 degrees here. Feels like 40. East winds at 9 miles per hour. Pressure at 30.23 inches and steady at the airport right now. If we look pretty much see how we're playing out the night tonight, things start out cloudy. It almost seems kind of eerie and unreal that we'll have snow in the next couple hours. But we do get a mix, rain mix around 12 possibly. And then we start to see the transition from snow around 4 a.m. So if you want to stay up, what a good way to do it. Here's what is in effect right now. Winter water alerts, winter storm warning here in pink, winter weather advisory for most of the Sutter counties in portions of Erie County seeing there. McCullough is still in the pink here. So they're basically seeing some winter storm warnings. And what that does is this basically the chance of what's going on with the snowfall is still kind of up in the air with temperatures and also in seeing how many inches. So we have this upper level low that's pretty much riding this trough axis. As it moves here, we'll become pretty much underneath it. That's going to swing in all that moisture and help give us the lift we need to get precipitation. Then we start to build into a ridge as we go into the rest of the week. And that's why we'll start to see temperatures go up and also rainfall. So if we plan out this weather weather we start off rainy as you can see around 1 30 a.m turning more to snow and even getting a mixing here eventually drifting down to interstate 10 then as we go into more of sunday into early sunday notice pretty much all the big country and pretty much all of uh, san angelo is basically covered in snow with the mixing moving further to the south before falling coolly snow as we go forward and even getting a little taste of a back end of that low as well before Sunday evening. So something to look forward to for tomorrow. So here's the areas that are most likely, likely impossible. So if you live in Cro Crockett County, Sutton and Sliker and even Campbell, you are possibly to see a rain mix and also some snow accumulations here. This is accumulations of snowfall. If you live in the San Angelo, that's Heartland, San Angelo, McCullough, pretty much extending into Erie, you're likely, most likely for the big county, that is the big bullseye there for the areas they're expected to get. So if we look at what we're expecting inches wise, and again, this is GFS model here. Things are associated to change. This is not really set in stone, but this is just a taste of what you can get. Pretty much here in San Angeles, expected now within the next 24, 48 hours, five inches here, roughly here. So, roughly between four to six inches expected here in the big county, rough, roughly between five to eight inches here. So, that's a big taste here. So, what you can do if you're going out, just prepare for those. And these are the areas, again, if you need to look at them. You can't rule out, again, changes in those snowfalls. So, they're not set in stone as we go into the next couple hours. And if you're driving on the road, it's best to just stay indoors, stay off the roads, and, and pack our emergency kick as well. And just also be prepared and stay weather aware. That's the best way you can do. But things clear out as we go into the rest of the week. And we still have to get through tonight. Tonight, though, getting down to 30 degrees before warming up only 4 degrees and then seeing some snow showers into the next five days. Things are just going to change after Sunday. Cloudy for your Monday, but then turning sunny and clear for the rest of your week. We'll be back with KSN News. CC Roofing, San Angelo.